Welcome back to the show. Some comments from the state statistics service in Ukraine this morning. Q2 GDP down 4.7% year on year. It follows a 1.1% contraction in the first quarter of this year. Yannick, a quick line on Ukraine here because we continue to focus on the situation with Russia yes. and the east of Ukraine, but not actually the fact that, you know, at the same time, we know that this is a country that's yes. not only struggling, not only struggling with the east, the loss of Crimea, but also the fact that it's going to have to adhere to a pretty stringent IMF EU program going forward too. Yes, I mean, first of all, it's a human tragedy in, uh, in, uh, in Ukraine because you have more than 1,000 uh, lives uh, lost in, in Ukraine. Having said that, the economy is, uh, is, you know, is in a very poor state, first of all, because it's impossible to do business in some part of the, uh, of the country. It's impossible to collect tax in most of the country. The currencies are all over the place, and all in all, the, uh, and the banking system probably will need recapitalization, which has not been done so far. Uh, there's a lot, a lot of uh, problem area, and it's very difficult to, uh, to see how this year they will be able to turn around uh, the economy. It's an awkward one, isn't it? Particularly if you've invested and thought that the political situation with Russia was going to end in a, a few months. We're going to be talking about that a little bit later on in the show, but uh, let's move on to our other earnings.